Linda Buck started working on the mechanism of smell with Richard Axel in the mid-80s after coming across a fascinating scientific development. As soon as I read a paper by Saul Snyder on the olfactory system that discussed the possibility that there were receptors for odorants, that was it. I knew that that's what I wanted to do. The first challenge faced by Axel and Buck was to find the receptors in the nose, which are crucial to smell. It had been proposed that there were protein receptors that recognize odorants, and, but no one had been able to find them. So that was the initial work that I did in Richard Axel's lab, searching for those receptors. After three years, Axel and Buck found the receptors. They knew that different smells arose from different molecules. However, they needed to find out how the combination of receptors with these molecules actually produced the experience of smell. And a mystery was how it is that these different structures are perceived as having different odors. These two molecules have almost identical structures, and yet they have different smells. One smells like pear, and the other one like banana. Genetic experiments then led to a surprising discovery. There were literally thousands of receptors involved in smell. 